download Telugu Stop Android app in Play Store or iOS app in App Store and stay tuned to latest news as it happens. Hyderabad, January 8th, Bharat Rashtra Samiti, BRS, Leader K, Kavita on Monday exuded confidence that the party will wrest the Nizamabad Lok Sabha seat from the BJP in the coming general elections. Kavita, who has already declared that she will contest once again from Nizamabad, attended the constituency-level preparatory meeting presided over by BRS working president and her brother K.T. Rama Rao at the party office in Hyderabad. Rama Rao stated during the meeting that unlike in 2019 when there was a direct fight between BJP and BRS, the constituency is likely to witness a three-cornered contest this time. He mentioned that an analysis of voting trend in the recent assembly elections shows that the BRS is ahead of both the Congress and the BJP in terms of votes polled. KTR, as Rama Rao is known, told party leaders and workers that regardless of assembly elections result, if they work hard to represent the interests of Telangana people, the party can win the Lok Sabha elections. On the defeat of the BRS in the recent assembly polls, he remarked that electoral victories and defeats are not new for the party. The BRS leader said that the Congress won the elections because of its 420 promises, and alleged that the party is now going back on its promises. Kavita asked BRS leaders from Nizamabad constituency to do self-introspection. She urged them to ensure the party's victory to give it as a gift to party chief KCR. The MLC expressed unhappiness over the performance of MLAs, saying they did not give priority to workers. Kavita, who is daughter of KCR, has already declared that she will contest once again for Lok Sabha from Nizamabad. She is likely to once again face BJP's sitting MP, D. Arvind, Arvind, son of former Congress leader and Rajya Sabha member D. Srinivas, had defeated Kavita by a margin of over 71,000 votes in 2019. The constituency had hit Heed Lane Nush, s after 177 farmers jumped into the fray demanding remunerative price for turmeric and red sorghum and setting up of a turmeric board, taking the total number of candidates to 185. Kavita, who had won the seat by 1.67 lakh votes in the 2014 elections, had been targeting Arvind for failing to fulfill his promise of the turmeric board. The acrimony between the two leaders had reached its peak last year after Arvind had allegedly made objectionable comments against Kavita, following which her supporters ransacked the residence of the MP in Hyderabad. Arvind had unsuccessfully contested in the recent assembly elections from Koratla constituency, a part of Nizamabad Lok Sabha constituency. The BRS retained the seat, Kavita had served as the BRS campaign in charge for Bodhan and Nizamabad urban segments, both part of Nizamabad Lok Sabha constituency. The BRS lost Bodhan and Nizamabad urban to Congress and BJP, respectively. Out of seven assembly seats in Nizamabad Lok Sabha constituency, the BRS won three seats while Congress and BJP bagged two seats each. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to channel and click on bell for more daily videos.